Okay, we have Pretty Coco. Today is January 30th, and she came back into our program today. Um, she was adopted seven years ago, and her person died, unfortunately. But Siamese Rescue is here for our kitties, and so Coco came back. She actually started out in our program in 2005 when she was just a, a little girl, just a few months old. Um, she was adopted back then, she lived with a family for three years until they had a baby, and she didn't like sharing her, her people. Yeah. So she was returned in 2008, and then, you know, adopted from with this last person, and when her person died, Siamese Rescue came to her aid again. Um, I'm told she doesn't like, well, we know she doesn't like kids, at least early on in her life she didn't. I expect that has not changed. I don't have kids, so I'm assuming, you know, I'm just going to not send her to a home with kids. Um, I'm also told she's not a, a fond of dogs. I don't have dogs, but I'm going to assume she can't go to a home with dogs. Um, she's basically been an only cat um, her whole life, so right now I'm assuming she needs to continue to be an only cat. Um, when I get another foster or two next week, after everyone has a chance to settle in, I'll see how she does, but I think it's just safe to... <laughs> Safe to assume, whoops, she doesn't want to live with anybody but her people. Um, you can see she's very friendly. <laughs> um, I'm told she doesn't like to be picked up. However, I've been picking her up and she did fine. Um, I'm also told she will jump in laps and likes to stay in laps, but on her term. So we'll see. I'll test her out on that too. She just got here today. so. I haven't had a chance to make my own assessment of her. I'm going on notes that we were given um, from the daughter of the owner who just passed. Um, so they're pretty thorough notes. Um, so if you ask about Coco, I can share all the information we have on her. Um, so we do have a lot of information. Um, you know, normally we don't. We get cats from the shelter normally, and we don't know much about them. But with Coco, we have a big history of, of, of her. <laughs> um, I'm going to call on Monday, today is Saturday, to get an appointment with my vet. And I assume she's going to get a clean bill of health. I mean, she, she, uh, she seems to be very in very good condition. Yes, and very sweet. Very, very sweet. So 11-year-old... Only kitty, no kids, no dogs, you know, nice quiet home um, for the rest of her life, which is going to be years and years. She's still a, a young kitty, considering Siamese Rescue or Siamese Kitties live to be well into their teens and early 20s, um, and she's 11, so... She deserves a good home for the rest of her life. And if you think you could provide that to her, let's uh, let's talk about it. Come here. Come here, baby girl. See, she's so friendly. Yes, Coco. Yes, Coco. I'll try to get some still photos of her, but you can see how beautiful she is in this video. Yeah. There's a big lawnmower outside right now, just started up. Doesn't seem to bother her at all. <laughs> Doesn't seem to bother her at all, no. Okay, here's Miss Coco.